why my next truck is going to be a three-quarter ton. So today I went and bought wood pellets. There's 30, 40-pound bags on the back of my truck, 1,200 pounds. Now the gross vehicle weight rating of this truck is 7,200 pounds. And it weighs 6,200 pounds dry as equipped. So not only am I overweight 200 pounds with pellets, consider the tools I have on the truck and myself as a passenger, I'm not doing the truck any favors. It's probably not safe, technically. And uh, I think I'm just gonna upgrade to a three quarter ton. I'd like to know your thoughts on that though, the people that own them, because I've never owned anything heavier than a half ton. And I realize there's a trade off with fuel and I'm not gonna be able to run, you know, restricted parkways and things like that due to the weight. But I think it's gonna make my life a lot easier because not only do I haul pellets quite a bit all winter long, I also move, you know, considerable amounts of firewood, gravel, stone, things of that nature. Not all the time, but I do occasionally have the need and this truck simply can't handle it. Not only that, but notice the bed width on this thing. It's very, very narrow and it takes a pretty skilled forklift operator to put a skid of pellets in here without tearing the sides off the truck. My new truck or new used truck, I will commute with it. Not all the time because we have three cars and there's always one of the beaters to drive or the beater, the Jeep. But I am probably going to commute with this at least a day or two a week, I would think. Let me know what you guys think. If I should make that switch, simply get another half ton. I definitely want to get something. I'm going to keep the Avalanche, don't get me wrong, but I do want to get another truck. Thanks for watching, you guys. Let me know your thoughts. We'll see you on the next video.